Pterodactyl, get out of my fishing spots. Well, folks, welcome to Fat Man Fishing Sunday's Tips. We're going to do today how to rig and use a trout magnet. Okay, let's first look at how they come. They come in many colors as you can see here. This is not even close to all the colors they have. It's different, many different colors. Okay, now let's look at the hook. So when they get one out, bam. The hook that comes with it. They do not work very well if you do not have the hook. Now let's look at, now let's look at the jig head. It's a 164th ounce. As you can see, it's got a nice little slant on it. Shaft comes around. The trout mate does not work the greatest and properly if you do not have the hook. So I have the right tackle for the right floor. Do an approved clinch knot on it. Let's, let's go over how we do that. You do an approved clinch knot on it. How you do that is you put it through the eye hole there. Come up so far. Wrap it eight times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And now at the bottom, right above the eye hole you just put it in, there should be a little loop that you've created. You put it in that through that loop. It's hard for me right now because my glasses are getting fogged up. There we go. Once you're through the loop, put it in through a little bit. Now you've created another loop, as you can see right here. Put it through that loop. Hold on to the tag in. Pull the other one. It'll start cinching. When you get close to just a little bit, lubricate it. Pull it. it gives a nice little knot. Okay? Cinch that right up. Get rid of your tag in. I always leave this a little bit. Just like that. Good. And that's how you tie the hook on. The jig head. Now, let's go over the trout magnet. Trout magnet, if you look at it, it's got a flat spot. Okay, you want that flat spot facing in when you hook it. Put it right down the hook, right down the center of it. And just kind of work it around the shaft. Whoop, a little farther. And then you come out right between the tails, just like that. See that? Flat parts on the inside. Why? Because water will come, you want it there, so when you're putting it through the water, the water will come through here and it'll split these tails. If you have the other one, it just works around, it doesn't work as great. So that's the rig up. That's the, that's the trout magnet in the rig up, how you do it. Now, let's go on how do you use it. is not heavy i said it's 164th ounce therefore it's not going to go far so the lighter the line you can use and you feel comfortable with the farther you'll get it out there you can put a split shot all oh, 12 18 inches to help out but i found that without a weight on it it works a lot better let's go over how to use it toss it out let's take it for a second you shake it one to three inches Going to how to use it. Toss it out. Reel it in slow. Shaking it one to three inches. The tip right there. You see my tip shaking? Toss it out, reeling it in, shake the tip one to three inches, nice and slow. And there you go. A beautiful bluegill, looking in blues. 
All the trout magnet. Catches trout, everything. I hope this all helped you.